Hi, welcome back. Today's quick tip is on old style log log scales. Uh, these are the type of log log scales that you would have seen commonly on uh, duplex slide rolls before kind of the late slide roll era right up until the end of production. Uh, so as an example I have this uh, post trig uh, post 1462H slide roll made by Hemi. Um, this slide roll um, it's from the early 50s, I think produced in the late 40s. Uh, and before it was produced by Hemi, uh, there is a Charvaz uh, version produced uh, during the war for Post um, with the same scales. I uh, see so what I'm talking about here are these log log scale style that you see on it. Uh, underneath here you see a later uh, Hemi model 259, uh, which essentially replaces this slide roll. Um, and you can see the log log scales that here it has here are very typical of late model slide rolls. Um, you have kind of a symmetric arrangement, um, and you have at least uh, six log log scales typically. Um, this one does have the extra two scales on the other side. Uh, but you can see on the earlier slide rolls, uh, so this slide roll, um, for example, the earlier K&E 4081 slide rolls. Um, that series. Um, they have log scale, log log scales that are like this. Uh, you see there's none on the other side. Uh, so what you see are the three LL scales, LL1, 2, and 3. Those are actually identical to these scales, so um, nothing to talk about there. Uh, the difference is these scales, the LL0 and LL00 scales. Um, <clears throat> what they are is they are log log scales for uh, bases between 0 and 1, so they run backwards. Um, but instead of being keyed to C and D, uh, like they are on the newer slide roll, they're keyed to A and B. Uh, so you just have to use them with A and B instead of C and D. Um, so the advantage of that is, with only five scales, uh, you get an extra extra decade of, of log-log scale for negative bases here. So it's actually, you have, you have uh, see here from here, one, one decade, two, and then three, four. Uh, instead of uh, here with the same number of, or with one additional scale, you still only have three because uh, you get only one for entire roll length. Um, of course, this slide roll makes up for it by having that extra fourth, uh, fourth scale on the back. Um, okay, uh, so the downside of that, of having the extra, extra range, is uh, accuracy. Uh, because the scale is compressed and it's keyed to A and B, uh, you have less uh, less accuracy and less precision than you have on the uh, the newer roll, um, but you do it in less space. So let's see how it looks. Um, oh, before we do that, another downside is uh, you cannot read reciprocals directly off them. So on, for example, this slide roll, if you find five on LL three uh, here, uh, then on LL zero three you see reciprocal zero point two directly. Uh, this will no longer work on the older slide roll. Uh, because they're keyed to different scales. Okay, now let's just do a couple examples. So if you want to do 0 0.995 to the 7.5, uh, we can find 0 0.995 here on the top on LL0. Then let's find our index. Okay, and see what I'm going to use is B, where I would normally use C on the newer slide roll. So on B, I'll go out here to 7.5. Uh, then I'll read result up on LL0. Looks like about 0 0.963, maybe in a hair. So 0 0.963, let's say 1. Okay. Uh, now remember, here's, here's the thing. If you, let's go back to 0 0.995. Um, the newer style slide roll, if you read one scale up or down, that's a difference of power of 10. Uh, but here, that's going to be power 100. So actually, what I see over zero point, uh, under 0 0.995 here, um, about, uh, let's see, 0 0.605 there, uh, that's actually 0 0.995 to the power 100. Okay? So, if I want to find 0 0.995 to the 7.5, okay, 75, I mean, uh, 7.5 was here, so 75 is over here, it's off scale, so uh, here's one convenient thing you can do. Uh, you can use the middle index of B. Okay, if I use the middle index of B here instead of the left index, um, 
for this purpose, then actually every, all these calculations are on scale now. So here's this 7.5 uh, would work for the 75 power. So let's see. So we've we've gone across LL0. Now we're down on double zero. Uh, so that looks like um, about 0 0.6, uh, 6, 6, 6, 7, 8, 8, 7. Or so. Okay. And then the 750 power, that's going to be on the next 7.5 over, over here. Okay, so 750 power, again on double zero. Looks like 0 0.1, 0 0.2, maybe 0 0.2, 3, 3 or 4. Okay, you can use these scales to do exponentials and logs with natural base. Um, by reading directly against A. Uh, so again, if you're looking at the A scale here, this one, um, that's going to be e to negative 1 read on LL00. And then for other, uh, for other decades, you need to go here, 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 or here. Um, okay, so let's see. So negative 2.1, I should read that here with B at 2.1. So 2.1 on B. And then reading up on this half of LL00. Looks like point, uh, point one, uh, one, two, point one, two, two. Okay. Uh, you can do that in reverse to read the natural log. Oh, and of course you can do uh, logarithms with, with other bases using B. Let's just do a quick example. Uh, so you would do 0 0.5 here on LL00. Uh, then find your index. Let's just use the center index. Okay, then coming out to uh, 0 0.15 uh, here. Then I can read that logarithm here on the A scale. Um, or sorry, not on the A scale, on the B scale. It looks like 2.56274. Uh, okay, uh, let's check that last one. Uh, let's get a calculator in here. All right, so just going to check that. Uh, let's see. Looks good. 274. Uh, Alright, hope you enjoyed this video and now you can use your older style log log scales um, on your older K&E 4080 series uh, or on a post-trig slide roll like this. Uh, have a good day.